Hello guys, welcome to my class. Today we are going to learn how to design and analyze and module a spiral staircase on Stack Pro. So, I first open Stack Pro, click on new project, click on space, we can give a name. Mm, select length unit meter and force unit kilometer. You can change the length and force unit if you want to. Click on next, click on everything and finish it. So, for the spiral staircase, we are going to edit stair data. Okay, this is the shortcut way of modeling a spiral staircase okay now here is a input with 79 enter it and write from your keyboard in space in space kilo newton as in the word unit then again enter name time joint code d need cylindrical sorry cylindrical reverse okay then enter then give the coordinate the coordinate will be one space one space 0 space 0 comma space 24 space 1 space 3 space 360 again enter 25 space 3 space 0 space 0 comma space 48 space 3 space 3 space 360 now this is the coordinate okay now save the data and close it and you have a spiral structure see this is our spiral flight okay now what is the coordinate I'm going to on the nodes for that shift in and you see the node number and go to the editor what I just do is this is the first one okay the 24 number is the last one on this line and this is the first one in that portion 25 node distance 3 and the upper is 48 distance 3 ok and 360 is the degree you can go to the top view and see that this is circle actually ok now close it now we are going to add the plates ok so for that we are going to use the generate surface machine ok at first we are going to go to the scale and switch on the fill plate solid surface why we on the fill plate surface fill plate surface sorry because you can see the difference between the upper flight and the lower flight ok so click on apply ok now select the generate surface machine and start with this node ok make sure you are going to start from this node select 
these four nodes and close it this is quadrantal ok change the division to 5 and apply now you see this is the this is one color uh, or in the back the top bottom and the top top color is um, sky I think and the bottom is as color okay so go to the symmetrical and switch up the nodes number by shift in again and now create the rest plate okay again i am going to add it by start here okay be careful when you add the nodes going to quadrant machine and change the division to 5 apply again start here and quadrilateral ok 5 and this process is same for the rest of the slide so I am going to just speed it up no shortcut for this type of structure okay if you are thinking about shortcut then forget it take your time when you do the spiral stair because this is very difficult and complicated structure Make sure do not all of the nodes. Now there is finish with some plates. Sorry.
you can change it to or you can decrease on sorry decrease and increase the division This is the last one. Now, our spiral stair module is complete. Okay. This is the down, and this is the top. Okay, if you switch off the field flat, you can't see the difference. See? Now tell me what is the uh, what is the down? You can't tell tell that okay. So that's why we are going to need the field flat on and now this is the one. Now I am going to fix the stair. So go to the support page, create, go to create, select fixed, add it. Now select support and select the nodes. Okay. Select and pressing control from your keyboard make sure you don't select the wrong one okay now click on ascend to selected nodes and assign it now our stair is fixed okay now I am going to give property, go to thickness, go to trade element thickness, give the thickness 0.2, I can change it, add it, close it and play and it goes to the whole structure, you can go to the plate crusher, select the total plate or you can just go to as to view, I am going to select the plates by plate crusher and click on as restricted plates and assign then yes and then go to the 3 render view see this is our stair this is everything ok beautiful ok now I am going to give some loads go to load test detail click on add load type dead and also live okay so this is the dead one you can change the title here sorry dead change double click on the load test to and you can change it to like the title change it, close it, for the dead load click on add, click the self weight and plate loads 1 in the local z direction, it is similar the as the dog leg stair and the self weight goes to the full structure, so we go to the as end of view ok and the plate load also goes to as end of view because there are no different member okay on this drawing 
big on live load it goes just uh, live loads plate load one kilo newton local set direction add it close it now it goes to the center view you can check the load by just increase it now apply ok now go to the front view zoom it you can see this is downward so we are going to give the unit as negative change it close it now this is the on the upward ok see Similarly for the line load minus 1 and change it close it now you have to analyze it for that go to analyze print here or you can go to command analyze perform analyze ok analyze run analyze save this may take some seconds okay so good news there is no error no warning no notes so go to the output file okay there is no error go to the post processing and then check the animation click on deflection See, these are moving on dead and live dead load. Go to the plate, stress type, maximum absolute. Sorry, plate, maximum absolute. Apply. Okay, now you see the stresses. this is the high this is the low so this is the high and this is the low then output the reports go to output and you can select what you need or you can select all these and click on ok and this is your output and the design part is the same as that dot list here ok you can design it ok so that's it that's how you wanna design analyze and design a spiral staircase on step 2 so that's it and thank you for watching my video